welcome. This is Melissa Arm of the Stock Swish, and I'm going to talk to you today about winning versus losing. I've heard so many stories in the last 10 years since I have taught people how to trade my gap method since I started the Stock Swish business, which again was 10 years ago. I've heard so many stories of people that have lost money. So many stories of people that have lost money, that have traded, they've lost money, and they didn't know what to do. Don't trade the stock market if you do not what to do, know what to do. Do not risk more money than you can afford to lose. And learn how to trade, learn a system, learn a strategy before you risk any money. This should be common sense, but so many people will risk money and trade ideas, they'll get in webinars or free chat rooms or watching videos, and they don't know what they're doing at all. And then they wonder why they lose. You, the only way to be consistently successful is to learn what to do first. Then you apply the method and then you do it. I have heard so many stories, like I said, in the 10 years I've had the business about people that they've traded and lost money and done this and done that. And, I, and, and again, I, I can't really sympathize with people because if you don't know what you're doing, you should be risking money in the market. Trading isn't gambling. It's just not. And it took me three years to develop my method. It was That was a long three years for me. And I did take one class when I first started out trading. I absolutely did. But I didn't learn how to make money in that class. I learned a basic foundation for technical analysis, which then enabled me to create my own system. But I paid someone for the first class that I took. So you cannot just you know, think of this as a gambling adventure. You have to have a set thing that you do every single day and you apply it and then you do it and then it works and you put your risk on and you get out when you're up and something that you have that you can use Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and in any market conditions. Just taking crapshoots and ideas from things is not gonna get you where you wanna be. And again, you're not gonna have any conviction or confidence in yourself when you're doing that either. And everybody wants to make money, don't lose. The only way not to lose is to learn what to do. And in order to do that, there's a cost. And you come and you want to take my class. My class is $69.99. It's $7,000. You will pay me for that class if you want to learn my method. And if you don't, then you can go learn something else that's probably not going to work that's a heck of a lot cheaper. So it's a commitment. It's a time commitment. It's a financial commitment. But in the long run, in the long run, and the long run, I don't mean years from now, it could be days, it could be weeks till you recoup the cost of the class. You will learn what to do. You will ask me questions. You will feel confidence in yourself because you'll feel like you know what you're talking about and doing when you put money on a trade. You'll be able to risk more money in a trade than if you didn't know what to do, which is also important as well. It's too competitive out there for people who are trading. Everybody wants to do something. There are people that went long today, that lost, the stock fell in Adobe. The people that shorted today were the ones that profited it. Again, I call this in the live trading room today as a short. We did puts in this too. You've got to be in the right side of trains. People are on the wrong side right now in many things, the market in particular as well. You've got to look at what you're doing and have a reason and a foundation behind it. It's, there's, it's, it's a foundation. And when you're just looking at it like gambling, you're not going to be successful and you're going to lose. I had a person that sign up for the options newsletter, he's doing very, very well. Again, I do not know how much he's risking per trade. I know he's doing trades that cost at least $5,000 or more per contract because he emailed me, he was up 13.5 in an Amazon option. So I know he had two contracts of that. But I have had conversations with this gentleman where he told me that last year he lost $200,000 trading in the market. I don't know what he was doing, he didn't tell me. Maybe one day he will. Now he just decided to sign up with me. He's been with me since I think the end of February and he's doing well and he's doing well. You know, even all the losses you ever had since the beginning of time that you ever, ever had, we didn't know what you were doing, you were doing wrong stuff. You can make up the ground if you start today fresh with a bright, you know, good attitude, learn something new, understand what to do, get on board, do it right, play to win, play for the long the long play okay the long play is not a quick in and out with a quick idea it's the idea of going forward to make money today tomorrow for the next week the next month the next year and so on and so forth you will eventually make up all the losses you've ever had doing the wrong things if you just get on board with something that works so again i think people get in their head with this and they just want to continue to trade without really learning what to do because again they've dug themselves into the holes at least this gentleman was smart enough to realize you know that i knew what i was talking about and then signed up and he's doing well so again i don't know where he's at so far since he started up but i gotten several emails from him he's happy he's making money and then when he told me what he lost last year i thought my god i don't know what he was doing but it obviously didn't work and two hundred thousand dollars is a lot to lose in a year's time for anyone <laughs> rich or poor so at the end of the day, think about what you're doing. Don't lose money in the market. You have to win. 
And in order to win, in order to be consistently profitable, you have to learn what to do. There's a cost involved with that. Again, that's what it is. But you look at it as a long-term thing. It's an investment in yourself, an investment in your own future, an investment in your future to be successful as a trader. And it will pay off for you. It's a time investment and a financial commitment. If you're interested in more information, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com for upcoming classes. Have a great day, everyone.